welcome back to some more Fortnite Save the World. This is episode number 14, and I'm so excited about today's because today is big progression in the main storyline. We're going to be doing something called Van or Astro Van. It's the main mission that's going to finally allow us to go over to skill tree number two. But before we get started in that, I asked you guys to help me make a big decision on whether I was going to get the hero Wukong or I was going to get the schematic for the copper Easter egg launcher that are found in the event tab over on the loot section of the game, right? Well, I went ahead and did neither and did something totally else. So if you click on these dudes, it kind of tells you everything that can happen with them as you upgrade and then eventually evolve them. And so I was looking at everything and Wukong looked all right. I mean, besides his skin being completely awesome, like he looked kind of just all right, but all right, he's a mythic hero which I didn't realize when I made this decision. I'm just now seeing it. So that's better than legendary. So that's probably pretty cool. Are these all mythic heroes? Hang on. Legendary. Oh, I think I screwed up. And legendary because what I ended up doing, gang, was getting the hero Shamrock Reclaimer who is an Outlander legendary. Oh, I missed out on a mythic. Oh, Lord. Okay, don't kill me. But then I went ahead and leveled him up a little bit. And this guy, much like our uh, last Outlander that I was using in the last episode, um, has the the teddy bear and the loot llama except him as you start to upgrade him He focuses more on the teddy bear making it stronger and stronger and last longer and do more damage and all kind of cool stuff So uh, I've got him leveled up uh, This guy's not leveled up. But the one that's in my inventory is leveled up uh, Pretty far. I think up to level 12 right now um, also instead of having to go around the map and collect shard fragments to power up my special ability now with every 60 kills i get on husk it powers it up so we can use a special ability without going around and having to search for a way to charge it up which is awesome plus i'm really enjoying the outlander they're just great for getting all the loot you need in between doing main quest so today we're jumping in to van or astro van and we're gonna do that right now let's get inside the map and give it a try okay so here we are we're in the mission van or astro van where our goal today is to find the launch pad and then fortify the launch pad with defenses and we're going to be launching a rocket today now this is a level 15 zone and i am going to try it solo we'll see how that goes if that doesn't work i'll get some randoms online or maybe even jump into my friends list because i see that quite a few of you have sent me friend requests and i have added you um i know that i had some settings that were a little bit um restrictive at first but i changed those so now anybody can send me a friend request sorry about that so send them away lag and yt some people are asking me what my epics account name is i have no idea what you're talking about i'm so sorry i would love to cross platform game with you guys so I don't know what that is. I don't know where to find that. All I know is my PS4 account is lagging YT, all right? That's what I've got for you. I'm so sorry. I need metal though. I feel like this is definitely gonna be a metal build. Is this gonna blow up? Let's find out. No, thank God. I really thought it was gonna blow up. So yeah, obviously I need some metal as you can see, not looking too good on that. And I did not bring my supply crate that I could jump, that I can call in from the sky and get some uh, materials from. So I'm gonna have to do this the old fashioned way today. Now, one of the things about this Outlander, when comparing it to the girl that we used last episode, on her fifth hit, it's called the Sweet Zone, and then she would activate a special ability on her own to where she could see through surfaces and walls and stuff, and it would highlight for you where loot is. So you could literally see like chests and ammo crates through walls and stuff with her, uh, briefly. But with this guy, he doesn't seem to do that. However, he does have the punch attack that she has, Plus, he's got another one. Plus, he's got the teddy bear. Plus, he's got the loot llama. Obviously, he's a better hero um, rarity as well as he's a legendary. And she was only an epic, I think. So, I, I feel like I made a good choice. Well, I've got plenty of time to get Wukong. In fact, I've already saved up like an additional... Oh, yeah. You guys in the comment section, thank you for this. You were telling me to launch myself off a box of fire. Watch this. This is great. You can see the whole map. Where's that rocket at? Where is the launch site? It's over there. We know where it is now. That's awesome, man. You don't take any fall damage. Thank you in the comment section for that. See, your comments are more important than you realize. I literally read them all, and I love that you guys are helping me out in this series. It's so much fun. There's so much to do, and I just, I, I haven't gotten enough of it yet. I've really been enjoying it, so thank you kindly. As far as Combat Pro goes, I see that a lot in the comment section. I will be giving that a try. I honestly i just keep forgetting to change it so when, when next time that i'm like doing off 
video stuff like you know just gathering wood or building up my uh storm shield defenses i'll try to remember to change it okay and then uh on the next episode hopefully i'll be used to it right and then we can uh we can give combat pro a try you guys says it makes it a lot easier to build and switch weapons so definitely want to be trying that out let me collect some of these envelopes because shamrock dollars are still on the table while this event's going if we get enough tickets sham or not shamrock tickets um firecracker tickets if we get enough firework tickets we can get another special loot llama which would be dope now i almost have 2000 v bucks saved up so i can buy some pretty special llamas but i think i'm gonna hold off for a little while not quite sure what i want to do with my v bucks i told you guys last episode that i really enjoyed uh battle royale i gave it a chance i played it one game finished third or second rather third finished third and quite enjoyed myself right and i noticed that my v bucks that i'm earning over here for save the world are on battle royale as well so i could buy all the cool skins so, so basically battle royale is free to play right but this costs me money however now they're paying me to play this because the value of a v buck is through the roof right so like one skin's equivalent to like 20 dollars, and i have enough for i pretty much have enough for that new uh that new skin that everybody likes the grim reaper or whatever it's called maybe raven or something i don't know what it's called but um so basically i'm getting paid now to play this through v box whereas the free version you're get you're paying money to earn those v box it's crazy it's a it's a role reversal and i love it i love it i'm just gonna keep searching around for some stuff and why did i just hear fireworks go off that's really weird what's going on in the ceiling here hang on what is going on above me let's check it out gang i wonder if there's anything up here oh oh i hear shh there's a chest somewhere everyone hush i gotta find it i think it's on the roof because now i don't hear it anymore all right back up to the roof all right back up to the roof we'll do this my, my crazy building skills we'll get up there eventually yeah i think it's right above me on the roof actually it's amazing i noticed when i was playing uh battle royale compared to and now i don't hear anymore compared to uh save the world the the chests are so much louder in battle royale i mean so much louder it's crazy there's a chest in this building and i'm finding it let me wait for these uh, envelopes to fall down and we'll uh we'll go investigate a little bit lower in the building i think it's in this tower right here but man i can't i can barely hear it and i've got headphones on and they are jacked up they are jacked up oh y'all gonna all fall off the side of the building none of you're gonna come on the top huh all right well whatever whatever none of them wait wait what's that that's not an envelope okay i gotta find this chest because it's gonna drive me crazy it's around here somewhere i literally can't hear it anymore chest please stop it oh hey sh hey fragment thing where is it guys oh there's an envelope right there though all right you know what screw this chest we don't need it i don't need a chest i want the chest wait is it right below me how can i hear it so perfectly right here it's nowhere is it behind this wall get out of the way wall oh my god i'm gonna go insane i'm literally gonna lose my mind I'm, I'm done. Just run away from the building, Lagan, or you'll stay here for an hour trying to... F I'll tear the building to the ground. When I have free time, when I'm not recording, I will tear a building to the ground to find what I'm looking for. You better believe it. Now, I forget which way we were pointing, by the way, <laughs> when I said, oh, where's the uh, where's the rocket pad? Remember we found the rocket pad? Yeah, I, I don't know where that is anymore. Completely lost track of which way we're pointing. I'm going to go ahead and clear out this encampment while we're here. Why not? wake up boys it's time for you all to die get rid of the b guy always get rid of the b guy first he is the worst in the game like they can throw as many miss miss oh my god miss monsters as they want at me right but when it comes to the b guys i'd rather deal with a mist monster than those b guys if you kill the b guy quick enough they're not that big of a deal but jeez louise can they take a lot of freaking uh health from you and shield they're insane hey we got a present what we get a whole lot of nothing charge fragment okay so we've got two charges and like i said when we get 60 we'll get a third charge for our special and notice that i have a new special it's like a tesla coil you put down on the ground and it shocks the enemies it just keeps zapping them it's pretty cool i like it a lot i'm gonna do another one of these hey yeah i didn't do it i want to do it again so we can find the uh, rocket one more time where was it 
It's in one of the corners. Oh, it's over there. Okay. All right. So we'll go to the northeast and get those in just a second. Someone said, Lagger, will you please not do any edits for one of your video? Just do a whole, like, two-hour video with no edits. We'll save that for, like, a special number. Like, you know, episode 25 or 50 or something, right? Yeah, I'll do one. But you, you got to understand how long that would take for me to render out the video and then to upload it to YouTube literally would take my computer a, a few hours and then definitely a few hours of uploading because my upload speed is atrocious. It's absolutely terrible. How much how much metal do I have yet? Uh, almost enough. I just want to keep collecting metal, guys, and we're going to go check out the rocket and see what's going on over there. Hey, you guys remember I was looking for that chest and it was driving me insane. It was nowhere near where I thought it was. So I thought it was on the down there it's all the way over here good lord i couldn't have been further off but i found the chest and that's what's important and watch it's really not gonna give me much of any yeah whoopity do whoopity do a silver automatic sniper rifle and some crap crafting stuff great still collecting me that was so much damage look that was a hundred percent damage that's not good but don't worry i can fix that a little bit there we go a little bit fixed Holy crap. Right, I gotta get some more metal. Check it out, guys. That thing looks huge. It's an actual rocket launch. This is gonna be awesome, man. All right, let's check it out, see what we've gotta do. So I think pretty much, I just need to build a defense around it, deposit blue glow when I'm ready. Um, Why is it outlined like that, though? I'm not quite sure. Here, let's put some blue glow in and see what happens. You need more blue glow. You don't have any blue glow to deposit. I'm pretty sure I just put two in, Ray, so don't tell me what I don't have. How is there a blue glow? There's one up here. Hang on. Let's get one. There's one right up here. I see you. I see you. Oh, there's a couple right there, too. Cool. So we're going to get some blue glow. We'll shove it inside of the rocket. And let's see what it suggests we do. I'm sure Ray's going to yeah. say, like, build up defenses and then launch the rocket when you're ready or something like that. And it's probably going to be a... Oh, look at this fella. Kill him. Oh, I hate these mist monsters, but I think this is like a... I think it's part of my spring event. Eh, don't touch me. I hate you so much. All right. Yeah, yeah. Mist monster slain. 10 out of 38. Eldritch Abomination Stage 5. 6 out of 25. So one of them requires me to kill mist monsters with a dragon weapon, which is what this is. And the other one just wants me to kill mist monsters in general. So I've got two of those mist monster things going on at once right now. Which uh, I think about V-Box and, and maybe some tickets and stuff. So it's good to get those done whenever I see a Mist Monster. But they're pretty few and far between unless you're doing uh, like the final defense stage to a zone. Which we're about to be doing. So I'm sure. And a level 15. So I'm sure we're going to be seeing some Mist Monsters here real soon when I start it up. This is going to suck though. Doing it by myself. Well, I'll give it a go. Why not? Did, did I not put the put it in? All right, there we go. Need a three. Storm data has been updated on your mini -map. All right, so we got some husk spawners down the hill here. And we've got some back over here. How many are over here? Looks like just two. That's not so bad. Just going to be two over here. There's one up top. Whoa! How did I almost fall off the edge? And there should be another one right here somewhere. I don't see it, but it's, it's around. It's around. So there's two there. And possibly the same amount over there. That might, that might not be so bad. That might not be so bad. So I just need to build up some defenses around this. And I'm thinking metal is going to be the way to go today. And this is great because we can make this nice and tight all the way around. Upgrade probably, I'd say. Actually, I'm going to bring this out a little bit so I can open a door and deposit more blue glow if we have to. But I'm going to say, I don't even know what I was about to say. I say we'll upgrade the bottom two levels just in case there's some throwers and they start breaking the wall a little bit. Top two should be good. And then I'll build some defenses around the perimeter of this box I'm making. All right, I'll bring you guys back when I'm done building. And then we're going to start the rocket defense. This is going to be awesome. Okay, well, I built what I could. This is going to be rough. They are surrounding us. Like, I did not read the map correctly. They are literally all around us. I've got a defender over here. I built all of this. I had to go back out and get more material. I got backup metal just to repair what I can repair. When it's time to repair, I got some traps over on this side, healing pad on this side, a bunch of wall darts on this side. And then these main points where they'll be coming up at is traps and walls. And then the same on the front. And I've got some spawners back here that are going to come from the back side. And I'm just going to hope that I can deal with them. And that's what we're doing. Let's launch the rocket. 
Everybody, one like equals one prayer. Do it now. Why am I doing this by myself? I have no idea. I didn't upgrade any of this on the inside. What was I thinking? I don't have hardly any brick left, so whatever I can do here is the last of it. Let's get some in the front right here real quick. And that's it. That's all I can do, I think. Yep, we're done. We're done upgrading. I can upgrade that second tier, but I'm going to save my metal. I think we're going to need it. Big time. All right, activate to start defense. Yay! Sorry. All right, only two minutes for the first phase, I'm guessing. All right. See, look, those guys should go right into my trap, as should the dudes spawning over here. And I'm just hoping my traps and stuff deal with them. Now, over here, did you just walk over a wall? Where did you even come from? We got traps over here that'll freeze them. Look at that. That's cool. And it does residual damage, I believe. How did you get over the wall, man? I gotta watch that. And then over here, I have to watch, too. I got some... Oh, my darts are doing work. Hey, big guy, what are you doing over here? Why don't you get lost? How does he get over? I gotta watch that. We're gonna have to do a full wall there, I guess. Oh, he's not over yet. He's not over. And, and sword lady, I put you in clearly the wrong spot. I need you down here, but it's too late. We'll do it in between things, maybe. I can't even repair... You guys are just stepping over my quarter walls. Jesus, my third walls. My one-third walls. Yeah, this is not going to be easy. But I got this. I got it. I love these freeze traps, man. They're awesome. I put them up all over my home, uh, my home shield defense, so it'll be a lot better off. Now, would you please maybe just don't do that, friend? Here, you know what we can do? I believe I have some extra just, like, random nonsense here. We'll just lay that down there. We'll lay some of that down there. Hey, is my, is my, what's going on over here? Defender, are you down already? You even trying? It doesn't look like you're trying. Doesn't even look like she's trying, gang. Did she, she left. And she, all right, she's given up. Oh, she came back out. She had to take a pee break. It's fine. We all have to do it from time to time. Hey buddy, what you doing? Well, they're not, they're not getting through the stone yet. You know, and then they got to get through metal too. So, I mean, this kind of area I have set up right now is just more or less, just kind of a another thing they have to get through. What in God's name is this thing? Oh, I think it's a launcher. I didn't even know I put that down. Look at you. You're all frozen. I'm going to save my ammo real quick. I'll we'll go down here and check all these traps in between. Let's see what happens next. All right. Stage one. All right. Launch pad is now repairing it, said. I don't... Oh, uh, I bet I bet it's building the rocket one stage at a time. So this looks all right. Again, it's too bad I don't have any way to fix that. I don't have a loot llama. I didn't bring my crate that drops supplies. Really should have thought that through. And I really don't feel like going out for another 30 minutes to get more stuff. But probably should do that. So let me just get some stone and repair some of the stone stuff. Maybe uh, break the defender pad and move it somewhere else. A little, little more. It's going to be a little better for us. So let me do all that and then I'll be right back. Okay, well let's start round two. I added a, a defender here. Change that wall. And I don't know what's going to happen now, but at least I got someone covering the back. Where did she go? Is she inside again? I have no idea. I got a little more, um, a little more brick and fixed up some stuff. I don't even know where she's at anymore. She's gone. It's okay. Here, let's do this. Deposit some blue glow. Wait, do I have an upgrade still available in the store? Do it. Nice. I'm going to go ahead and upgrade some of the stuff right here too. If I can. Okay. I think we're good. Let's kill some baddies again. That was the stage one wasn't that bad. We, just, we found some flaws in our design here. Hopefully we got them fixed up, but now we're gonna have tougher enemies. So obviously some skull throwers. I wouldn't even doubt it if we got our. Well, that's that's not part of the game, is it? Oh, did I not start it yet? Hang on, I haven't started it yet. My bad. I put three uh, three. It costs three again to do stage two, so I'm probably gonna have to go out and get blue glow after stage two is done. Lots of blue glow to get this going here. Activate. All right. Good luck. I wouldn't even be surprised if they threw in some um, mist monsters as well this round. So we'll see. Because I think I heard one coming last round. I want to watch right here. How are they getting over here? It says our fort's under attack already. How's that even possible? Where? Where are they attacking from? It seems like they might be attacking from over here. Hang on. Let me see what's going on over here. Yeah, they are. Because my sword defender's gone. Did that dude just open a door? Oh, she's in there. She's in, she's such a coward. I love it. What is wrong with her? Good God. All right, so they just broke right on through here, huh? Zero Fs given to the door that was here. We can beef it up a little bit. Let me just kill that dude. Let me, uh, we'll do a metal one right here then. See how they like it now. 
We'll upgrade it a little bit too here in a second. Just keeping my eye on stuff. Looks like my traps are holding up. I mean, sounds like they are. They're beating up one of the traps right now. They're definitely, stage three is going to be rough because we're probably not going to have those traps in the front and side that are holding them off for right now. I just want to upgrade this. This is the slowest thing ever. You need a construction, dude. All right, how are we looking down here? Doing its job, doing its job. What's going on over here? All right, we got some inside somewhere. Yep, there we go. Get out of here. All right, did you break something? Now we're oh, I hear a big monster. He doesn't seem happy. Let's kill him with a dragon gun, and we can get some extra points. Don't you break my stuff, homie. How about no? How about get punched? Okay, I just punched my own wall, completely missing the giant beast that I'm stuck inside of now. Great, this is all working out great. Put that down. Give him some shots. Give him some shots. I gotta get the final shot in with my gun, though, for this to count. Yeah. Oh, no, I didn't get him. I didn't get him yet. There he goes. He's gone. Nope. Uh, yeah, gave me credit for both of those things I was trying to do. Remember, I gotta kill him with this specific <laughs> dragon gun, and um, the other ones just kill him in general. So, either way, I was gonna get at least half credit for that. All right, where are we getting attacked from this time? Probably on the other side where I put up the... Oh, you guys are breaking it down over here, huh? Breaking it down. What you gotta do? Get frozen. All right, I think we got some problems around the corner here. No. This is holding up for now. We're gonna hit the repair. It's just one dude over here beating it up. We got 30 seconds left. I think we're gonna make it through stage two just fine. And then uh, probably just gonna have to repair some of the outer defenses. The inner defenses seem to be holding up except for the walls. Uh, but it ain't the worst, you know? Where's the bumblebee man at? I see his bees everywhere. Oh, we got a... Uh-oh. Uh-oh, they gave us two Mist Monsters? This isn't good. All right, bear out. Deploying bear. Oh, uh, there's like no time left. I didn't need to waste that bear. He ran from the bear. I see you running from the bear. I'm not going to get the kill on him either because time ran out. Yikes. All right, we can fix this up, though. Although, I don't think I have any more nuts and bolts to make any more traps. But we can at least throw the wall back there. And we're going to go ahead and just do metal on that one. Let's do metal on this one. Boom. Um, where else do we need metal? We'll do metal here as well. Uh, let's see. Yeah, that's probably fine. Actually, do it with a window in it. Oh, I have two days to finish this mission. Is, is the rocket building? It is! We got one more We got one more level to do. Last stage coming up. I think it's going to be three more blue glow is what it says. So I got to go around and find some blue glow real quick. Shouldn't take that long. Uh, let me see if I can plop a trap. Although I, I just don't think I have what I need to make any more traps, guys. I've, I think I've used all of my resources basically for trap building. But let's find out really quickly. Do I have anything that can get slapped on the wall? I can make some darts or a punching thing. Let's do some darts. Let's do some darts. Um, and that's about it. That's all I can do right now. So we're going to put some darts here. Boom, bam. Which is probably what we had in the first place anyways. And I'm just going to... I'm going to triple upgrade this as soon as it's finished. They're not even coming to this side. They're going straight for this side. Is this floor damage at all? No. So they're just banging on this wall right here. All right. So that's been triple upgraded. That will definitely be better than the stone. So wave three might not be that bad right there. I think we might have found a solution for this wall i've just got to notice where they're coming from by looking at the mini map and then i need to react and run over to those spots let's go check the front trap wall and see how it's doing all these walls are fine there um crap 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 i gotta run all the way around now <laughs> i've made this in a way that i can't really get around very well dang it okay you know what here let's do this do that right there and let's go over here and what do we got down here? Dude, this one's holding up great. So they come up to the wall, they get punched backwards. By then, these spikes probably have reset. So then they hit the spikes again and get punched backwards while they're getting shocked, while they're getting darted from both sides. This is actually a really good contraption here. It's working well. It's not taking hardly any damage. All right, so um, I think that we're good on repairs. The front side is not taking anything. If they do break through though, they're gonna get punched backwards. They decide to come from one of these walls. They'll get darts to the face. I got this sword lady who keeps hiding inside, driving me insane. I think we're good. Let me just, um, yeah. Upgrade that. All right, I'm going to go get some blue glow. And then, guys, we'll be doing the third and final stage. And I have a, I have a sneaky suspicion we're going to watch that rocket launch. This is going to be great. Now, if we got two mist monsters in stage two, 
Just imagine what we're gonna get in stage three. All right, I got the three blue glow. Let's finish this up, man. I'm really excited about this. And I think, I think we've done pretty well. I might've overbuilt here, not sure. Jeez. Actually, I didn't even do the recommend build limit, which I never do really. Yeah. But stage three might be ridiculous. Look at the rocket, that is so cool looking. All right, activating now. Uh -uh. Let's use our shotgun a little bit this round. I've got two bears. I'll probably get a third as I keep killing more house. Um, and we'll use those. I gotta remember to use my punch from time to time as well. It's really helpful when you find yourself kind of surrounded by the undead. Yeah, you shoot those fireworks, buddy. You're doing great. Look at him, yeah, he's getting them. Awesome. Yeah, so it would be a lot better if she stayed outside. I don't know what her obsession is. With being inside, she seems to really... Oh my god, look at all the ones that came over here. Oh, there she is. She's helping now. She understands how serious this is. You see, we can punch right now. That's probably a good idea right there. Okay, except I'm stuck. Not great. All right, I gotta go find the, the skull creep somewhere. Where are you? Where you at throwing them skulls? She's down below. I'm gonna go get her. I got her. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Oh my god, they surrounded me. They trapped me. Dude, I'm not safe. I gotta get up here. Here, don't worry. I've got some healing potion right there. Just waiting for you. Good thing they can put out some healing pads. Thought that was probably a good idea. Yo, why are they coming in so hot on this side? They love it over here this 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 time. Here, I'm gonna switch back. Oh look, you remember last episode? I said, hey guys, really want an automatic freaking AR? Got one. It's not a legendary, but I got one. I think it's a. What's underneath legendary? I think it's that one. Epic. Oh, that guy, that guy. Watch out, watch out. Watch out. Where'd he go? Where did he go? God, her bombs are just destroying everything. Where's this guy at? Okay, we gotta kill this dude. He's the voiced. Get him lagging. Oh, he's coming in, he's coming in. Ooh, don't touch me. I hate when you touch me. Did I kill him? Is he dead? I don't trust it. I don't trust it. I may have killed him. Yeah, I killed him, I killed him. How's the other side of the base looking? I haven't been over there in a while. Hopefully she holds, hold strong, girl. I'll just see what's going on over here. Everything's looking good over here. All right, we got some more health, which is great. We got two more minutes left on this. I think I'm gonna throw a bear down over here because I bet they are all up here now. Yep, get them, bear. Get them, get them, get them, get them, get them, get them. So the bear lasts super long now compared to the girl's bear. Because like I said, as I upgrade, as I upgrade um, with this, this particular Outlander, he focuses on basically bear upgrades. So the next, the next upgrade for the bear, I think, is additional damage. And then after that, I believe it's going to be something like laser beams out of the bear's eyes and more critical chance. So I think right now he lasts almost seven seconds longer than the bear we were using in the previous episode. Oh, God, there's something else coming. I heard it. Holy sh... I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you before you get me. Ow. Like I planned. Oh, I hate this dude. With a passion, throw another bear down. Help me out, bear. Help me. Have we earned another bear yet? Oh, man, I got two backup bears because, like I said, you kill and you get more bears. It's just great. It's not time-based. It's kill-based. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 50 cents left. I think a bear needs to go in here now. <laughs> they got through over here. Oh, baby, not good, not good, not good. That right there for now. Uh... Pretty sure we're gonna make it. Maybe, I got two more bears again. Just keep throwing bears down. The bears will protect you, Lagan. We got 30 seconds. Oh, I think they're inside the base. Still, oh crap. They didn't get through the metal yet. Still haven't gotten through the metal. Get them, bear. 13 seconds, dude. We got this. They can't destroy that rocket in 13 seconds. Look, it's got 5,000 out of 6,000 health. We good. Did it all by myself. Level 15. Defending the rocket. I want to watch this thing launch, ladies and gentlemen. We have earned this. And we're going to go check out Skill Tree 2. Once it's done, there it goes. There it goes. Oh, that is awesome, man. So, I don't know what the purpose of the rocket launch is, but I think it probably has something to do with depleting the storm and logic something in outer space that's going to help us with the storm. I haven't really been paying attention to anything Ray ever says to me. Awesome! I can't believe we did it. Holy crap, we got a level 6 loot chest! Oh my god, the dream is real! Let's go open this thing and see what's inside of it.
Okay, level six loot rewards. Never had over a level four. So here we go. I think maybe once I got a level five with play with other people. So we got Survivor XP 900. We got Crafting Copper Ore, which is great. And we got 62 Shamrock Dollars. It wasn't that great. I mean, this stuff's good. That's always good too. It wasn't the greatest, but what do we get for finishing the mission? The threshold, Commander. We, started at Survivors. we get a player we jump pad up. And we get a player jump pad directional. I don't like jump pads at all, really. So I'll probably... I don't know what I'll do with those. I'll probably just recycle them for some more schematic XP. So by launching that rocket, it has now let us go to the next town called Plankerton. Let's take a look at it. Yeah, and this we have a storm shield that is set at 0 out of 10 over here. Nothing else unlocked. So we can start that um, for the next mission that we play. In fact, that is the first thing that it wants us to do. Um, but we still also have three more defenses to do back in Stonetownwood place. What's it called? It is called Stonewood. Nailed it. Nailed it. Now, one thing I definitely want to check out is my skill tree. Is it going to let me do it now? Can I go to skill tree two? Finally, I've got 44 skill points. I'm going to fly through skill tree two now. Oh my God. Next time we play... I'm going to have some new stuff to show off for sure. Looks like we can go to the second skill tree. So I'm going to go ahead and purchase that. Let's roll. Did I do it? I did it. I think maybe. Yeah, here we go. I am interested to see what we've got here. So you've got ranged combat building, core, uh, scavenging, and melee combat. And the tree goes all the way over there with lots of goodies in between. So I'm going to dive deep into this. I'll catch you guys up on what I have done in the skill tree. And if we got anything cool and new that I can explain in the next video. I guess we're going to be doing Plankerton, a whole new town. Thank you guys for joining. If you enjoyed, drop a like on it. And as always, it's been your boy Lagan24, and I will see you uh, next time.